Hi, I'm Hank. Illusions are a great way to think like a scientist because you have to come up with explanations to things that seem impossible. As a bonus, sometimes illusions are really just goofy and fun, too, and this activity is definitely one of those. To do it, you need a glass bottle, a dime or other coin, a straw, a cup, and some water. You also need access to a freezer. First, set your coin over the mouth of your bottle. Then carefully put it in the freezer and leave it there overnight. I did this yesterday, so I've already got my bottle ready here. Next, fill your cup with water, and then put your straw in your cup. Press your thumb or finger on the straw. That'll create a seal, allowing the water in the straw to stay in there, and then you can let it go. And we're gonna want our water to bubble up around the sides a little bit of our whole situation there. Now, sit back and wait. <laughs> Besides being funny, weird, a bit of a surprise, this experiment relied on some cool science. But before I explain it, can you make a prediction based on what you know about the world why this happened? Here's the secret. You can't see them, but the air around you is made out of tiny pieces called molecules. Normally, they move really fast and are spread far apart, but when the temperature changes, they act differently. When I put the dime on top of my bottle, I formed a seal, like a bottle cap, and it trapped some of the air inside. Then, when I put that bottle into the freezer, that air got cold. When air gets cold, the molecules in it start to move more slowly and get closer together. In other words, the air gets more dense. When I took the bottle out of the freezer, the air in the bottle started to warm up. The molecules spread farther apart and began to push on the dime and the walls of the bottle. By pouring water over the dime, I created another seal over the top of the bottle as the water molecules stuck to each other and to the bottle. Eventually, the air in the bottle pushed so hard on the the coin that it popped out and made a burp. Once you've done this activity, you can also try it using a bigger bottle, or you could see what happened if you left the bottle in the freezer for longer. If you find out anything cool, you can leave us a comment under this video. Thanks for watching.